if you actually break down the market into the little segments of one bedrooms, two bedrooms, three bedrooms, you see that it's really a tale of multiple different markets. In the last couple of months, we've actually seen an increase in the prices of one bedrooms, a relative increase also in the prices of three bedrooms across the city. The prices of four bedrooms actually went down slightly. Why do you think this is happening? Well, I would expect that it probably has to do with the large co-op market uptown of unrenovated product that's having difficulty selling in this market because so many buyers are afraid to get in there, put their hard hats on and do the renovation. And what's going on with one bedrooms? It's probably because those are the buyers that are affected the most by how crazy rents have gotten. Did you know what it costs to rent an apartment in Manhattan right now? I know people renting one bedrooms for five, six, seven, eight, nine thousand dollars a month. At that point, you start to do the numbers and you say, yeah, I might pay a little bit of a higher interest rate, but at least I'm gonna own a home and I'm actually gonna pay a little bit less than I'd be paying with these crazy rents. So if you wanna get out there and understand where real opportunity is, you need to look at what's going on in these submarkets because you're in one of those submarkets. So reach out to me or my team for some advice because I can tell you, we're in the market, we're in the trenches, we're seeing these opportunities and I'm sure there's something for you.